one of the foundations of what our team is in terms of like teamwork and collaboration and leaving nobody behind. That's just kind of what we stand for in a sense. We show up for each other. Yeah, they're a group that has an unbelievable amount of perseverance, personal strength, willpower. They have the urge, despite all the circumstances, all the stuff that they typically run into in their daily lives, they still find a way to come out and perform and do something that brings them another sense of like freedom and joy to their lives. It gives me inspiration, it gives me strength, it gives me reality that I can still do a lot of things that other people in their feet can do. I can complete marathons just like they can complete it. It's hard work, but it sure is fun. My name is Penelope. I'm from Brooklyn, New York. I have cerebral palsy. That's a disability that I've dealt with and lived with my whole life. I discovered hand cycling in 2017 when I joined the gym for people with disabilities called the Access Project. Ran in collaboration with two nonprofits called Willing Forward and Wheels of Progress. They had hand cycles there for us to try and use. Once I was able to use a hand cycle, I realized that my childhood goal of completing a marathon was possible. Um, and it's history from there. When Penny called me about, she's a captain of the team, and she told me about Pravelas and join the team and do races and do big things, marathon, and trying to go all over the world, you know what I'm saying? That was uh, all about. One of the main challenges that the team faces is transporting our hand cycles to and from races because it's not like we can just easily put a hand cycle in the back of a car and just go about our business um, without damaging the hand cycles. So it's very important that we have a way to transport them safely. Roadway does exactly that. They work with us to ensure that we're able to transport our hand cycles to and from races and as well as our training days to make sure that we're training properly for these races and we can reach our personal best on race day. And they also store the bikes as well, so that also helps. So we don't have to worry about going to multiple homes to retrieve hand cycles and do those things. The prevailers needed a place to store their custom-made bicycles. They need to move it from race to race. And we know that if we can help that community and can help that group, to find joy and fulfillment, we will do that. Without them, we wouldn't even get to the start line, let alone the finish line. She's really a captain, like, it's everything you could ask for in a captain, really. I'm gonna say it in one word, beautiful. When I mean beautiful, she's beautiful in heart, beautiful in soul, and beautiful in mind. Penny got me out here doing this and I didn't want to do it. So that's how beautiful Penny is. Beautiful. Prevail is going to ride out. I'm going to get my Ride out. I'm going to get my ride out. My fifth medal. <laughs> I'm going on my third medal. <laughs> I'm going on, I have two plaques. I want my third plaque and another medal. I'm shifting to the left too much, and I'm afraid that I might shift too much. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> And if that happens to me in the middle of going down a hill or something like that, it's not going to be safe for me. I'm not trying to end up on the news for uh, medical reasons, you know? Girl in hand cycle foot during RBC Brooklyn half. Breaking news. I'm kind of anxious right now with the whole strap situation, but I'm trying to... Uh, Calm myself down, and even if I'm not able to participate today, I will be cheering my teammates on, and I will be with the finish line, whether it's with my hand cycle or with my wheelchair. <laughs> and you get that assignment when you finish the crossing that finish line. Yeah, I was like, uh -huh. I did it. We did it, uh -huh. you know what I'm saying? That's right, we finished, that's what that means. We finished, all right, that's what that means. That's what it means, man. The ability to be able to like overcome is great. Being able to prevail is awesome, but also be cognizant of what your limits are and also hope that you soon live in a world <laughs> where one doesn't have to prevail so much.
Um, one of our immediate goals for the prevailers this year is completing the New York City Marathon. Um, beyond the New York City Marathon, just like Roadway, we want to go beyond New York City and race elsewhere. Um, so Boston, Chicago, LA, you know all of it.